Operation Reverse Double Cross. Our goal, as we all know, is to save Penelope. Given her crafty nature, Left Wee has undoubtedly locked her up in one of his most secure locations. They are, one, the Skull Keep, and two, the Brig of the Death's Head. Our team is too small to assault both simultaneously, so we'll have to fall back on a little slide of hand. First, we sail in and exchange broadsides with the Death's Head. Armed with the element of surprise and our cannon upgrades, it should be a fair fight. But remember, Penelope might be on board, so we cannot sink this ship. Once the mass fall, Sly should jump onto the enemy vessel and then promptly surrender. A necessary step for two reasons. First, that boat is packed with pirates. Way too many to fight hand to hand. And second, it's the best way to get an audience with Lafuit. Given his smug nature, he's sure to brag where she's hit it if we can get him angry enough. Got that Sly? Irritate the daylights out of this guy. It's our best and only chance to rescue Penelope. Once he talks, we roll out plan A or B, depending on the situation. This Lefui is a smart man. Our only hope is to outsmart him at his own game.
Battle stations, we're headed into action. It's gonna be tight sailing in here, Sly. Keep an eye on the rocks. Choice board in a ship packed with over a hundred pirates. Sure your cane is up to the task of cracking all our skulls. I don't know about all of you, but yours, I'm sure it can manage. Ha! Restrain this man and keep your distance from the enemy vessel. This smells of lubber trickery. Take heart, boys. Been a while since we witnessed the good plank walking. Your crew doesn't like me much, Lefui. Where'd you find them? A charitable home for cross-eyed deviants? Woo! Hear that, shipmates? The condemned man labeled you all waste of skin. Ha! Ah, how's that sit with ya? Stick him! Tear the meat from his bones! Let's drink his blood! It appears you're right, Cooper. They are deviants. This tank's got splinters in it. I thought a prissy sailor like you would take more pride in his ship. Oh, no! I take a great deal of pride work and splinters into the feet of those I'm about to walk my plank. Ha <laughs> ha! Just the extra touches that makes all the difference. Making me walk the plank? You're the pinnacle of creativity, Lefui. Not creative! I'm the smartest man in the seven seas, you... You slander scabbard! You've got a real knack for pirate talk. Put two nonsense words together and pow! Scary pirate name calling. Bah! You might be quick with the put downs, but who's got the hidden girl? Ha ha ha! Me! You'll never find her! Yeah, I suppose she'd have to keep her locked up. After all, if she ever got away, you'd never get a date. It is true, I have a strong personality. But I've never had a problem with the ladies, especially when I've a brute side aimed at their sailboat. Uh, savvy! I'm not worried about Penelope. A girl tough as that will free herself by tomorrow morning, then come and steal your wallet. Ha! That chickadee will never escape a skull keep. She's locked up in irons, and there she stays until she agrees to love me. Despite all my faults. Now be the time sharks launched on your parts. You're the captain. Step on it, Murray. They've got Penelope locked up in the skull keep. Check! What? The lovers getting away! After them, boys! Bend up the signal flag! Tis all our boy! Heads up, Murray. The whole town is trying to blast us. Drop me off at the dock. I'll make a run for Penelope. You keep the boat safe. We're gonna need it for the escape. Safe as a baby! Now get moving! Sly, there's a back route up the skull keep. Jump on the floating boxes. Penelope and I made a walkway all the way to the top.
Penelope, that you? It's time for a rescue. Lafui. <laughs> He's good. Ha <laughs> ha! The landlubber fell for it! Hook, line, and sinker! Thanks! Cannot maneuver the smartest man on the seven seas! Ha <laughs> Not hardly. First mate Jones! Aye aye, sir! Take a battalion of your best men and raid the Cooper ship. There's sure to be some lingering rats aboard. What? Uh, sir! Don't cut me off while I'm speaking, or I'll cut you off from breathing. The Cooper ship is making for the open water, sir. Hmm, rats indeed. Make full say what must we got. If they make it out to sea, we'll never catch them. Aye, aye, sir. Wait. Slides are blown up, and the fleet boat is gaining on you. Keep it together and meet me at the mouth of the harbor. If I can get into deeper waters, I should be able to give this guy the slip. But why? Keep it together. We're not done yet. Blast! They'll make it out to sea in this wind. Jones! Aye, sir. Load the cannons and prepare to come about. If the breeze don't help, we'll fall back on iron and powder. Fire! A boss there! Afraid he didn't quite make it out of the harbor. <laughs> Prepare to surrender your vessel. Sorry, Lafui, but I'm sure this water is deep enough. Deep enough to be your grave. Guru, Crusher, now! Oh, my thunder! This Crusher? Crusher! We're doomed! Ha, no, da, da! Horibia! Good to see you, too. I'll focus on freeing Penelope. You take care of any pirates that might come up on deck. Use the left and right analog sticks to control your tentacles. Then hit the R1 button and L1 button to smash guys. deal with this guy. Aye, that you have. Set me up to think I'd outsmarted you. Then pull me into the deep water with this beast. I tip me hat to ye. You. You're the cleverest man I've ever had the pleasure of beating. You getting this lie? Yeah, I've got some perspective on the situation. Avast! <laughs> Guru, get Sly! He can't swim! Aye, shipmate, but who'll be helping? 
Nobody touches that turtle but me. Me pirate flower finely blooms, yet ye favor this cripple over me, the smartest man on the seven seas. Oh, I do like smart guys. And he beat you at your own game. You tell me who's more intelligent. Be still my heart and quick me blade. Tis time for a duel. You and I'll make the mating dance of day. Use the left analog stick to jump and duck. Outsmarted by our own resident genius. Who'd done more than just rescue a team member, he'd won himself a girlfriend. It was nice to hear him talk, 
they'd have these conversations the rest of us couldn't even follow. As far as I could tell, they were made for each other. Dimitri was in love too. The new diving gear had gone to his head. We were informed that he'd be our frogman for the Cooper vault job. Not that any of us had even asked him. For the first time in memory, Carmelita didn't show up and cart everyone to jail. Oh well, I'll send her a postcard. You know, I'd hate to have her feel left out.